We're going to be talking to Dana Larson on Thursday morning on this show. He mailed shrooms, basically, to all of BC's MLAs over the holiday break. And some of them are, are really like speaking very out and like very upset yeah. about it because he mailed them illegal and illicit drugs. Shrooms were sent to 87 BC MLAs. Yeah. I'm pretty sure a couple of them went on a nice trip over the hall. I would suggest 40 to 50 of them. <laughs> Little taste. Probably. <laughs> no, but it all, yeah, at least I would say at least 20, wouldn't just, you? Just Probably. I would eat them. Some I would, I, I, Yeah, I would say 10 to 20 for sure. That would be my guess. Out of the BC politicians, uh, out of the roster. At, at, at You're the trying BC to get legends. me in trouble. I'm not answering that who question. Is, <laughs> who is the number one most likely to have eaten the shrooms within five minutes of them arriving? I can tell you it was definitely not Eleanor Sturko. She was definitely the most vocal She was upset. And angry. Yeah, I'm going to give Dana <laughs> shit for not putting in Johnny and I on his, email, on his mailing list. I, I think David Ebby might have had a little taste. David he, Eby, he, yeah, he, yeah. he was in those uh, gonna, indie rock bands. Didn't he do the vocals for those indie rock bands well, back in the day? Do, he's got to, as the premier, he's got to do his research. He's got to know what he's talking about. So, <laughs> okay, so we have it. So lock it, Johnny. If you want to just send that out from our official accounts, uh, Mo Amir points the finger at David Eby as the most likely <laughs> to have crushed shrooms. 